the Leaf party down here at Scotiabank is being expended tonight as the Leafs kick off round two of the playoffs. I'm here outside Scotiabank in Maple Leaf Square. Yes, it's going to be packed here, Maple Leaf Square, but the team is now allowing more fans in. They're going to pack Bremner Boulevard right down towards the Rogers Center. So we're looking perhaps at like twice as many fans enjoying the tailgate down here tonight. Toronto Police telling Breakfast Television they will have stepped up patrols to keep everyone safe. There will be road closures again, of course. It's puck drop at 7 p.m. tonight. The Leafs are hosting game one here. They'll host game two on Thursday before the series moves back down to Sunday. Rise, Florida. I'll tell you who's already celebrating this tremendous Leaf playoff push. It is the bars and restaurants here in the downtown core. I had a chance to talk to the head of uh, Jack Astors and Loose Moose. He tells me business has gone absolutely through the roof when the Leafs play in the playoffs. We could be upwards of, of a 50% increase on those nights. Um, you know, it's it's uh, it's huge. As we all know, this, this is kind of the first time in a lot of years that the Leafs are getting to round two. Uh, I think the excitement is crazy. So, yeah, we will definitely be looking at numbers, uh, numbers upward of 50% increase. So there is already a tangible economic benefit to what the Leafs have been doing. All right, are the Leafs going to win the second round series? I went right to perhaps the biggest Leaf fan in town, podcaster and Sportsnet's Steve Dangle. He's going to make his prediction. Are they going to win, Steve? You got it right here, just like against Tampa, Leafs in six. How's this for a stat? The Leafs have a better record in these playoffs playing in Florida than the Panthers do. The Panthers are one and two. The Leafs are three and oh. Let's go. Now, many of the sports books also have the Leafs now as favorites to win the Stanley Cup. Could this be the year? The first year since 1967. We'll see. The Leafs just hoping for a victory tonight. 